Okay, let's take a look at finding the value um, using the central limit theorem formulas uh, for Google Sheets. And um, it's a norm I and B, area to the left, our mean, and then our standard deviation divided by square root of n. So you're given mean, you're given standard deviation, you're given n in these problems. Okay, so let's, um, let's say our mean is 22, our standard deviation is 2, and n is 25. Let's assume it meets all the criteria to use the central limit there. And we're um, referring to the top 10%, assuming better is over here, they're telling us to put the 10% here, and it has to be in decimal form. That's 10%, this has to be 90%, because all of it has to add up to 100% or 1. And this is what we're trying to find here. So we have to identify the area to the left. Look at this line right here, the area to the left is 0 0.90. Now, uh, let's say we're looking at the bow tomb. Try that again. Bottom, 20%. <laughs> Check myself in a nursing home this afternoon. Um, bottom 20% is over here. If that's 20%, this has to be 80%. Not that we need that. And again, we're looking for the area to the left. So we're considering this line right here. The area to the left of it is 20%. And uh, just to change it up a little bit, because I think those are the two numbers I've been using over and over. Middle 90%. We put 90% in the middle. That means we're going to split 10% in tails. And we split it evenly, so this will be 5%, and this will be 5%. Now, first off, we're going to find this value, and the area to the left of that is 0.05. And then we're going to find this value. The area to the left of that, you have to add up all the decimal over here. So you add up 0.05 and 0 0.90, which gives us... 0.95. Now the formula we're going to be using for this is norm I and V. And again, area to the left, mean, standard deviation divided by square root of n. So for our first one, equals norm I and V. Um, 90% is our area to the left comma, our mean, which is 22, standard deviation, which is 2, divided by the square root of n, which I believe we said was 25. And then close parentheses on the square root, and I'll do a closing parentheses on norm, norm I and V, and then um, press enter. Again, because we just got our three parameters. And that'll give us our answer. Now for the next one. Norm I and V. Beginning parentheses. And let me get back there. 20%. 0 0.20 is the area to the left. Comma our mean. Mean is 22. Comma standard deviation, which is 2. Divided by square root of N, which is 25. Closing parentheses on the square root. Uh, closing parentheses on norm I and V, and then press enter, and that'll be your answer. Um, our next one, uh, we're going to do 0.05. So equals norm dot I and V, 0.05, comma, our mean, which is 22, Comma, standard deviation divided by the square root of n, which is 25. 
comma, or no, close parentheses, sorry. And then press enter. And I think next one is 95%. Yeah, 95. So equals norm.inv.95, comma, mean, which is 22, comma, starting eviction, which is 2. Oops, 2 divided by a square root of n, which is 25. And close in parentheses on norm i and v. And then press enter. And those would give us our answers. And that's how you find uh, values um, using the central limit theorem um, for Google Sheets.